Hello everyone, this is Teacher Kelvin and welcome to another episode of Maths I Can Do. Today, you're going to be watching a video conferencing lesson on the topic of solving math question from a renowned school. Question 23, four mangoes and three watermelon cost $54. The next clue they give you, three watermelon is the same as two mangoes. These two mangoes can be replaced with three watermelon. This two mangoes here can be replaced with three watermelon. This one will be another three watermelon. So altogether is as good as 54. 54 is how many watermelon? This is a unit. Unit, 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 unit. So how many unit can you see? Nine. They can see nine, right? Nine watermelons. Can you see? So nine unit is 54. So the next step, you take unit is equal to 54 divided by nine, which is six, right? Yes. So now this unit is six. Find the cost of a watermelon done already. Six dollars is the answer. Brady had a container filled with eight liters of water. So he has this container filled with eight liters of water. So what he do? He poured two fifth liters into bottle A and three ten into bottle B. How much water was left in the container? So it's eight liters. He put two fifth liters, right, into container A. And he poured 310 into container B. So just add them together. What is A and B added together? You change the same denominator. 2 times 2 here is 4. 5 times 2 is 10, making it 410. So that means he poured a total of 710. So finally, how much was left in the container? So he has 8 liters minus 710, which means he has, like this, you will break it up, he has 7 liters and one more liter minus 710. Yes? Okay, 7 liters and 1 liters, you break into 10 out of 10 minus 710. So you left 7 and 310. This is called the, leave your answer in mixed number. Do you understand? Yes. Seven and three tenths liters. Next, question 28. The figure shows a square. The parameter of the shaded part is 32. Find the area of the square. First, we need to know the length of the square. So what is the parameter means? The parameter means uh, they are the outside or the outside. Okay, so the parameter consists of here, seven. All these three must add to seven. So you have 7 plus 7. Do you understand why all these three must work up to 7? Because this is, you break them up and you join them. This one is all connected to be 7. This part, you see, you move it here, it will be joining here. Can you see? That's why all these three parts, although they are broken, they add to 7. I'm joining it there. Can you see that? Bang, they're all joined together is seven. Uh, red lines are on the left-hand side is seven. The three broken ones on the right-hand side all add to seven. Then what else? So I need to add this blue color one, yes? By the same understanding, this blue color one is broken into three parts here. You see, if I take again, uh, if I take this and move down, yes, it will be one part. So if I take the middle part, I move down, it will join here. Can you see? So if I take the third part and move down, it will be the three of the blue broken ones will join to one long blue ones. Can you see now? Yeah. And the long one blue ones, maybe we call this the length. Okay, so length. So you have the parameter is seven plus seven plus the length plus the length will be equal to 32 because you say the parameter of the shaded part, okay? So in that case, two length here, here will be 14, it will be equal to 32. This one is two length, here, two length, 
plus 14 will be equal to 32. So two length is equal to 32 minus 14, which is 18, yes? So two length will be 18. Length will be equal to 18 divided by two which is equal to nine. So find the area of the square. We are not done yet. Huh? The length is nine, the length is nine. So the area of the square is length times length. Yeah, okay, which is nine times nine, which will be 81 cm square. Thanks for watching. And if you like what you see, do give us a thumbs up, share, and subscribe. And for more great tips like this, be sure to watch Maths I Can Do.